Obstar DC706 Clone Renault EMS3120 ECU and Boot. Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel, your ultimate hub for automobile diagnostic tools and programmers. Smash that subscribe button, hit the bell, and show some love with a super thanks. Here's a detailed step-by-step -step guide to clone a Renault EMS3120 ECU using the Obstar DC706 in boot mode, along with the MP001 programmer. Step 1. Select Renault EMS3120 ECU. Power up the Obstar DC706 tool and connect it to the MP001 programmer. Quick search. Type and search for EMS3120 in the Obstar DC706 menu. Select Renault Continental EMS3120 TC. 1738 ECU from the available options. Step 2. Check the wiring diagram. Once you select the EMS3120 ECU, the wiring diagram will be displayed on the screen. Follow the wiring diagram to connect the MP001 programmer to the EMS3120 ECU. Wiring notes. Ensure that all connections are stable and correctly aligned to avoid communication issues during the process. Properly ground the ECU and ensure that the power supply is stable. Step 3. Connect ECU in boot mode with MP001. Select boot mode with MP001 in the DC706 tool. Boot mode is required to allow the tool to communicate directly with the ECU for cloning operations. Step 4. ECU communication. After selecting boot mode, connect the ECU as per the wiring diagram. The DC706 will now attempt to communicate with the ECU. First step. The tool will read the password from the ECU to gain access to its internal memory. Step 5. Read internal EEPROM of EMS3120. Once the ECU is connected and communication is established, select the option to read the INT EEPROM from the TC1738 chip in the ECU. Save the EEPROM data to a file. This data is essential for later use. Success message. The DC706 will confirm that the EEPROM data has been successfully read and saved. Step 6. Read internal flash of EMS3120. After successfully reading the EEPROM, Select the option to read the INT flash. The tool will read the flash memory of the ECU. Save the INT flash data once the reading is complete. Step 7. Disconnect the ECU. After saving both the EEPROM and flash data, press the disconnect button on the DC706 to safely disconnect from the original ECU. Step 8. Connect the donor ECU, EMS3120. Follow the same wiring diagram used for the original ECU and connect the donor EMS3120 ECU to the MP001 programmer. Once connected, back up the INT EEPROM and INT flash data of the donor ECU as a safety precaution. Save the donor's EEPROM and flash files in case you need to revert back. Step 9. Write original EEPROM and flash to donor ECU. After backing up the donor ECU's data, load the original INT EEPROM and INT flash data previously saved from the original ECU. Write the original data to the donor ECU using the DC-706. Step 10. Finalize the cloning process. Once the original data has been successfully written to the donor ECU, the cloning process is complete. Test the donor ECU by installing it into the vehicle to ensure proper functionality. Notes. Same process for EMS-3125. The steps for cloning the EMS-3125 ECU are identical to those for EMS-3120, so this guide applies to both. Precautions. Always back up both the original and donor ECU data to avoid any issues during the process. Ensure the power supply remains stable throughout the cloning operation to prevent data corruption. By following these steps, you will successfully clone a Renault EMS3120 ECU using the Obstar DC706 in boot mode with the MP001 programmer. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed the video, give it a thumbs up, leave a comment, subscribe, and hit that super thanks button. Until next time, happy diagnosing.